Hello gamers, 1.3 version is around the corner, so I made this video to calculate how many polychromes we can get. Hopefully this helps you plan your future pulls. In this update, we will get the opportunity to pull for both Yanagi and Lighter. Otherwise, we can save for Miyabi in 1.4 version. Just keep in mind that this is an estimation and the actual amount will likely be higher. With that aside, we will start this version by getting 600 polychromes from maintenance compensation. 1.3 version will last for 42 days, giving us 2520 polychromes from daily errands and an extra 360 from weekly errands. Shiyu Defense will get three resets during this period so that we can get up to 2160 polychromes if we manage to clear all the levels with S-tier rating. Moreover, we will get new game mode called Simulated Battle Trial. This game mode is said to have 85 levels and full clearing it worth around 3000 polychromes. On the other hand, Hollow Zero will get six resets, assuming that your internaut level is over 50, then this will worth 960 polychromes and six master tapes. Moving on, 1.3 version will introduce Yanagi special episode and lighter story quest, alongside bunch of new side quests and commissions. And by clearing all these quests, we can get around 1600 polychromes, other than that, we can get 300 polychromes from 1.4 livestream code, 80 from Hoyo Lab check-in, 220 from new characters, trust rewards and test runs, 150 from promo codes and Twitch drops, and at least 140 from Howl's scratch cards. Also, we will get new achievements which worth 165 polychromes. Now let's talk about limited time events. In this version, we will get five playable events that reward polychromes, starting with the main event, the mystery of arpeggio, which will give us around 1420 polychromes and a new free A-rank bangboo. Then the other four events will give us a total of 1400 polychromes. And let's not forget the 10 encrypted master tapes that we will get from all new program login event. More than that, when Fading Signal Shop reset at the start of December, we can get five encrypted and five standard master tapes, and we can get another five master tapes by reaching level 50 in Battle Pass. And lastly, we can get two more master tapes from Outpost Logistics Shop. So by the end of 1.3 version, we should have around 109 pulls saved as F2P players. In case you have Battle Pass, then you will get around 118 pulls. If you have Internaut membership instead, then you will get 132 pulls. As for players that have both Battle Pass and Internaut membership, they should get 141 pulls. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.